Hi friends, now we are going to discuss how we can put some colors in the output of uh, when we use the right shape. Okay, so let me show you. So if you notice, this is the condition statement and it does now some, something where it tries to find data. We will just concentrate on the output and later on we'll add some colors. Let me show you how it looks now before we put colors. Okay, so I'll just put P count and I'll execute. Okay. And once it's executed, this is the output. Now this looks a little blank. Let me put some colors in it. Okay, so how we can do that? So I'll just do this. And if you notice this, I just added call color three. Each each has a different color name. Okay. So if you want to see the different color names, you can go always go here and you can find the different colors. Okay, so let me see. Where is the color, 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 color? Here. I think uh, if you go here, this is the different colors you can put. Okay. So list supported colors. These are the different colors you have. Okay. This one color key, color positive, and all those things is there. So let me show you the different colors now. So I'll execute now. Uh, whoops. Okay. I need to activate it. Uh -huh. So now here we say pecant, we execute. Now you see all different colors. So you can see different colors. So each color icon, each color number I mentioned has a meaning. Okay, so so these are the different colors. Let me see if I click uh, go here and put color. Probably it will tell me all the color meanings okay uh, here color total using colors so here you can see different colors let me see and you can do other things so this is very important uh, so that's it stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and if you like it share it and subscribe to it and have a great day